good morning. I'm so tired. It's so early. It's too early for this. Honestly, putting this pillow on my chair though, guys, I'm telling you, it's the ticket. It's the ticket. Um, good morning. I'm rolling up. Um, I'm tired. Um, yeah, that's kind of that. Um, okay, so today's kind of a busy day. Um, that's why I'm here a little bit earlier today. Um, so today I am leaving to go to my mom's house a little bit early this morning in a few hours and then I'm going to go do a couple things at her house that I need to get done and then after that I'm going to get an echocardiogram today. So basically that's like a picture of your heart if you didn't know. Um, so I'm getting that done and then yeah I'm probably I might be spending the night at my mom's house. I actually don't know. Um, I'm undecided. So, therefore, today has to be a shorter stream, which is okay, because we've been streaming a lot. Um, so, I'm okay with doing a shorter one today. Um, it's just going to be a cozy, short, chill one today, if that. Um, it'll probably only be a few hours stream. Um, I was going to play Life is Strange episode 2 today, but because we don't have a lot of time, I don't want to risk like having to get off and not completing the episode so instead we're just gonna do um pokemon violet we're gonna just work on our blueberry pokedex this morning which i figured would probably take us a few hours anyways so we're, it's gonna be ultimate chill mode we're just gonna go find pokemons evolve pokemons it's gonna be really chill um and then uh, yeah and then i'll get off it's gonna be a very short stream and then tomorrow we'll be back on hogwarts legacy i'll be back to my normal schedule tomorrow streaming around like 9 to 10 and do a long day of hogwarts legacy again um friday friday we'll probably play life is strange again and i think we might be playing back rooms on friday again and or more horror games um but i'll try to fit in an episode of life is strange before that um saturday um and sunday are pretty open i might have a couple things that we're doing but um i have to confirm so anyways um yeah today's just pokemon violet and then i get my echocardiogram Fun times for everyone. I also have a doctor's appointment on Friday, but it's like really early in the morning. Like 7 a.m. So, you know, I should be back at a normal time that day anyways. So, but yeah, I hope you guys are doing uh, um, well um, as we head into this Wednesday. Um, I hope you guys are thriving. I'm definitely not. I actually had a fainting episode last night. So that was fun. Um, well, not really. It wasn't fun. Let's let's call it like it is. It's not very fun, but you know, it is what it is. Um, okay, I'm trying to open my switch to start. I have the Pokédex open right next to me, so we can refer to it. I am at a hundred Pokémon, and I think there's about two hundred forty. Which is crazy to me that they added that much Pokemon in just part two of the DLC. It's kind of wild. Um, there is a sale. Oh, we should go look at this right now, actually, since we're on the Switch. Uh, Nintendo has a the Mega Extreme Fun Sale. And I'm kind of intrigued by a few titles. Let's just take a look-sees here. Um... Let's go to great deals. Um, there's, uh, Nintendo rarely has like decent sales. Sometimes Nintendo sales are like 10% off. Okay. But they actually have a decent sale in a couple games. So I'm debating if I want to buy them. Um, hello, Darren. Good morning. Um, okay. So I'm thinking, um, there's a couple that had a pretty decent sale. I'm trying to find the ones. 
Okay, so the Kirby Forgotten Land game is on sale for 30% off. Like, these games rarely go on sale. Um, there's, like, only a few ni good Nintendo sales a year. So when they come, you gotta hit them up because otherwise, you know, you gotta wait forever. Hello Kitty Cruisers? What the fuck? This might be a, an insta buy for one ninety nine, guys. Hello Kitty Cruisers. My switch is not loading it. The fuck? Oh, it's just slow. Hello Kitty Cruisers. I never played this. This must be an old game. Damn. Anyways, um, there was a couple of games that I was... Imagine playing Dark Souls Remastered on the fucking Switch. Like, that would be wild. It looks like the Lego games are on sale on the Switch. Um, I only buy games on the Switch that are, like, easy, actually easy to play on the Switch, like cozy farming games I will buy if they're on sale on here instead of buying them on Steam because like you can actually play them. I'm not about to play an FPS game on the Switch, you know. It's just it's just not good. It's just not good. Um I I think I could play a Lego game though. So maybe it, we should look at the Lego games cuz they're all on sale, like a pretty good sale. But I mostly just buy, like, Switch-exclusive games, like Mario games, like Pokemon games. Those are the ones I tend to buy. Uh, none of the Pokemon games are on sale. Okay, let's hit up... There was a couple. I can't remember now which ones I was looking at. Oh, yeah, the Animal Crossing DLC is on sale. I don't have Nintendo Switch Online anymore. I don't pay for it because... Honestly, nobody plays on the Switch anymore anyways, so, like, I'm not about to pay for that. Mm, yeah, Metroid is on... Med... Med... Met... I can't say that very well. Yeah, it's on sale. The Switch rarely has sales. Like, this is not common, people. Um... Mm, even some Mario... Oh, yeah, this is the one. This one is 67% off, and it's a fairly new game. Mario Rabbids Sparks of Hope. We've, um... We played the first Mario Rabbids on stream, and now it has, um... This is the second Mario Rabbids game, and I, I have been meaning to play it, but... God, it's sixty dollars. But look, it's on sale for twenty. I'm getting an expansion pass for my dad for Father's Day so he can play his Switch. Yes, there is a big sale right now, so really look into it. I think I'm gonna buy this one because it's on a big sale. I, I love a good Mario bargain. Mario Rabbids Sparks of Hope takes place in a whimsical galaxy, the result of the merge of Mario and Rabbids universes. I was goaded at this game. But this galaxy is in danger, as Cursa, a dark entity, wants to absorb all its energy. Its influence has spread all over the world, and is has made visible by darkness. Storytelling? If something is for Cursa, uh, I usually buy it, yeah. ...to capture the sparks, born from the merge of Lumas and Rabbids. Yeah, because if you don't, it, it, the Nintendo Switch games hardly ever go on sale. Like the exclusive games, like the Mario games, the Pokemon games, the exclusive Switch games. And honestly, in general, the Switch barely has good sales. So this, you know, <gasps> there's DLC too. The fuck? Sparks of Hope DLC 2, 3. Where's DLC 1? I should buy all the DLCs too while I'm at it. Yeah, I think I'm going to buy this game, guys. And then I'm going to buy all the DLCs. And then we're going to play it as our next like Mario game. Because we haven't played a Mario game in a while. 
Mario. What's the season pass? Oh, here's the DLCs. DLC 1. Maybe this one's free. There's three DLCs and a main game. Like, this would keep us busy for a while, and it's on sale. The Tower of Doom. Not available for purchase. Why is this one not available for purchase, though? Do you have to buy it as the season pass? What's the season pass? Season pass contains upcoming DLC packs, including DLC 1, DLC 2. Are these not out yet? Why do they have three DLCs? Well, anyways, if you buy the main game for $20 and all three DLCs in that $17 package, you're still paying less than $60, which is the, the price of the game. So I think I'm going to buy this one. Yeah. It's just rare that they would put um, one of their new title newer this game's not brand new it's over a year old i've just never gotten around to playing it but it's kind of rare that they put a newer title um a newer title on sale it's not very common especially 60 percent off and i can use 70 cents of my rewards this is great so i'm getting a 60 dollar game for 2050 and then the dlc's Hold on, let me buy it. I'm buying it. Nobody can stop me now. And we're going to play it soon. Alright, hold on. I'm just... I'm just... Copping it. Hold on. Should I buy the DLCs? I probably should since they're on sale. Because I don't want to have to pay full price. The DLCs, so yeah, the main game is very, very good deal. What was the DLCs again? Um, oh yeah, it's 40% off. Like, it, usually to get these DLCs, it's $30. You're not going to ever see a sale like this, okay? You're not going to see a sale like this. The only thing I hate about the Switch is how you have to buy each game separately. You can't just add a bunch of things to your cart. Or can you? I, I don't think you can. It makes me buy it every time. Alright, well I'm buying Sparks of Hope. So we're going to play it soon. Within the probably the next couple weeks. Once I beat a couple current games that I'm playing. Probably once I beat like Pokemon Violet. Once and for all. You know then life will be great. Okay, I bought the DLCs. So apparently there's three DLCs and the main game. So, you know, that's kind of... That's kind of lit. Um, yeah, go check out the sale because it's... it's. I mean, some of the really good titles still aren't on sale, but like... You know, they're going to try to make their money off of the new Paper Mario. They're not going to put it on sale. Like, those really new titles, they're not going to put on sale. But they do have quite a bit of their bigger titles on sale. So I would go check it out. I think the, the we've also not played the Animal Crossing DLC yet. And I think it is on sale. Whoops. Yeah, any of, like, their new titles within the past, like, six months, they're not on sale. But... That's just, you know. That's just how Nintendo is. They're going to try to milk the game for what it's got. Why isn't this working? Maybe because I didn't have the space. 
Is that really why? This shit just doesn't work. I think this... Oh. I think this shit... It just don't work. What the fuck? Well, I don't have enough room on my Switch for this, but... Basically, I'm, I'll download it. So, now we have this game that we'll play soon. Probably kind of when I'm almost done with. Oh, I have a system update. That's great. All right, I'm going to let my system update. And then we're going to go into Pokemon Violet after we shop the sale. I love a good bargain, guys. Like, for me, there's very few games that I'll buy on release day unless I'm really, really excited about them. If I'm not really, really excited about that, like, well, a lot of games I get excited about, but, like, sometimes I'll wait for them to go on sale. And then I'll play, like, other games in the meantime that I did get on sale, you know. So, anyways... Um, I really wanted to... Hmm. Let me look at my wish list on here. I think on the Switch you can make a wish list too. Wish list. Here's my wish list. Well, actually I can't show you because it's going to leak my email to the side, so... But basically... Um, where is it? The... The... Well, I own this now. I can't believe Sparks of Hope has three DLCs. That's kind of came as a surprise to me. I actually didn't know that. I did not know. None of the Zelda games are on sale, which I've been waiting for them to go on sale for me to buy them and play them. I don't think they're ever going to go on sale, so I may as well just, you know... I should probably just buy them. Here we go. The Animal Crossing DLC is on sale for $17, which isn't bad. We still need to play the DLC. So, anyways, it's time. It's time for Pokemon Violet. We're working on the Blueberry Pokedex. So... We're just going to sit back, relax, and try to catch them all, folks. Um, I'm at 100. I need to get to 240, which is... Um, it, it's, you know, it's not easy out here. It's not easy. Ugh, I'm so tired. It's so early. Speaking of Father's Day, I have no idea what to get my dad. I don't even know if I'm going to see him on Father's Day. I don't really have a close relationship with my dad. I think I've talked about this before. But, like, I don't know what to get him. I don't even know if I'm going to get him anything. We're just not very close. I don't know what the man wants, you know? I think I was invited to go to his house on Sunday for dinner. So maybe... Yeah, $20 vanilla gift card. <laughs> that might be what is going to happen. That, that might be what's gonna happen because I literally don't know what else to get him and the thing is my dad okay my dad has plenty of money so it's like I, I, gift cards like my dad ha makes a good living to be honest so I it's like I feel like I can never buy him anything that's gonna like actually matter <laughs> So, anyways, yeah, I don't, my dad is one of those guys, if he needs it, he's gonna buy it himself. He doesn't really need me to buy it for him. 
So I don't, I don't know. And my dad kind of, he has everything he needs and everything he wants. So, like, he, he, if he wants something, he just buys it, you know? I don't know. That's just how he is, I guess. That is the most underrated gift ever. I personally really like gift cards. Like, I don't mind gift cards. These birds are swarming me. These birds are swarming me. Now I just need the two cannon. Oh, you bitch. But, yeah, I don't know what to get him. My dad really likes eating out, so maybe I get him a gift card for his favorite restaurant. My dad really likes uh, Texas Roadhouse, is one of his favorites. So maybe I get him a gift card for there. Yeah, my dad likes to eat, so. It's just kind of awkward, I'm not like very close with him. I don't talk to him very often. I, you know, I, I haven't seen my dad in like six months, if that tells you anything. Like, I, I, it's the type of relationship, like I see him on the holidays, you know? And I only see him on the holidays mostly because I am close with like his, his my grandma and grandpa on that side and like my aunts and uncles. So I like his family, it's just like a him issue, you know? That's kind of the type of relationship I have with him. I don't really see him otherwise. I keep forgetting to use the quick ball again. Damn it. Alright, I'll try to remember. But yeah, that's kind of that. So I don't really know what to get him. He likes um, sports clothing. So maybe... Because today I'm going into town... To get like my my to go to my doctor's appointment, so I was thinking maybe I stop and get him a gift, but I don't know what to get him. I don't know. It's complicated. I don't know why, but I feel like sometimes. I, I'm just drawn to these Pokemon without out of my control like I just run right into them and I'm not even controlling it Maybe a buck card maybe I don't I don't know v, v bucks cards My dad hates video games. Oh I already have this one Apparently, I have this one. It's just a different version. Well, we're gonna catch it because we don't have this one. This version. Yeah, my dad hates video games. He's a video games hater. My dad likes to barbecue and cook. So, there's that. But once again, he has like this very expensive grill, like $10,000 grill. So like he doesn't need anything else from me. He also already has a black stone. Like the man has everything, I'm telling you. He has everything he wants and needs. This one is foaming at the mouth. Actually foaming at the mouth. All right, I'm gonna remember to use a quick ball. Get him an apron chef hat just be- Okay, Darren, I actually already, last Father's Day, I had a custom grill master apron made with his name on it. So he does already have that, but he doesn't have the hat yet. But I, I actually did already get him a custom apron for grilling with his name on it. So I actually, you know, I did think of that already. That's what we got last Father's Day. 
All right, we need the two cannon. But yeah, I just don't know what to get him. I could get him some clothes for his favorite sports teams. But I feel like he already has a lot. Sam's Club Sushi. <laughs> I don't think my dad likes sushi. This thing looks pissed. Anyways, I'll, I'll figure it out. I mean, honestly, my dad doesn't really expect anything. He actually always says not to get him a gift. But then I always feel weird because my step-siblings always get him gifts. So I'm like, I'm his actual kid, so I should probably get him something. But like, I... My step-siblings are actually closer with my dad than I am. So, because they actually lived with him growing up. I didn't live with him. So... Yeah. I think men in general like being humble. I see stuff like that all the time for my birthday or Christmas. Yeah, my dad always says that. Like, he always says that. And honestly, I do think my dad means it. I think he really means it when he says he doesn't eat anything or want anything. I, uh, he's, yeah, he'll just go get it himself if he needs it, you know? That's how he is. He likes, um, he really likes Crocs, but, like, he already has so many pairs of Crocs. So it's like, I don't want to get him Crocs, because he already has lots of Crocs. You know? Anyways... Anyways, I'm screwed. I feel like men, I don't know. Maybe it's just because I'm not a man. I just find it hard to buy for men. And maybe that's just me because I'm a woman and I don't know what men like. Oh, damn it. I didn't see them there. Like, I don't- I don't know what I would buy him. I might- I'm pro I'm for sure gonna go get him a card. And then... hope for the best. <laughs> I think- I think a card and a gift card to his favorite restaurant. That might be the ticket. Because honestly, I don't think he cares about gifts anyways. He'll just be happy that I, that I came to see him, I think. Because I, 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 I typically don't go to see him. <laughs> but for some reason, he's been somewhat decent lately, so, you know, maybe things will go well. But honestly, I say that every time. I'm like, oh, maybe things will go well, and then it doesn't. So, you know. Some things never change, um, and I, I don't think he'll ever change, to be quite honest with you. He's gotten probably a little bit better since I was little. Like, it's not like he's, you know, punching me and smacking me anymore. But... Um, he still yells and is rude in that way. He's, a, he's more of like the verbal abuse now.
And it's like, I am 25 years old. I don't really need to be verbally abused, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just don't fuck with that, you know? So, honestly, I just choose not to see him because it just turns into a load of barnacles whenever I see him. But, you know, I'm, I might go see him on Sunday and see how it goes. The nice thing about being older is I have a car and I can just leave. When I was little, I, I couldn't leave if I needed to. We don't have this one. Alright, let's try a quick ball. So right now, I'm just kind of going around the terrarium here. And I'm just trying to catch whatever ones I know I don't have. Get like those easy ones out of the way. And then I'm going to work on the more difficult ones. And like the ones I have to evolve and stuff. So, and... We're not going to be able to finish the Pokedex until I trade with a Scarlet owner. Uh, uh, a Pokemon Scarlet owner, which my sister has Pokemon Scarlet. So I might ask her to trade for the last Pokemon. I'm sure she would. If she's got them. But we're going to finish everything up until that point. All right, what biome is this? Oh, this is the this biome. All right, let's go to the ice biome. It's the last one we haven't really like just walked around. And then we're gonna look at more specific like Pokemon that we don't have. So I think we have that one. I'm pretty sure. If not, they're not hard to find. Now, I don't know if we have these ones. Oh, I apparently do have it. It's just crazy to me that there's still like a hundred more Pokemon that we don't have. Like, how? Like, everywhere I turn, I already have caught it. So I don't know. I don't know if we have this one. I don't think we have this one. This one... Yeah, we don't got this one. I'm trying to remember to use the quick ball. Sweet. I kind of want to get Starbucks on my way to my mom's house today. Ooh, Starbucks. It just sounds good. Oh, I'm so tired today. I'm kind of like glad I have, I'm have. i doing a short stream today, to be honest, because I'm just so tired. We've been really grinding, so. The quick ball really comes in clutch, guys. It really comes in clutch. Let's go. Let's go. I don't have this one. I don't think. I think this one's new to this DLC. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Sweet.
Perfect. Excellent. Excellent. Yeah, a lot of, like, the third evolutions of each Pokemon, we're probably going to have to work on evolving some. Because usually, generally, they're not, like, out in the wild. Generally speaking. So, we're going to have all of that to do. Um... I don't think we have this one. Unless I'm just dumb. Yeah, we don't have it. That's what I thought. All of the Pokemon that are in the Blueberry Pokedex that were already in the game did carry over to the Pokedex. So we don't have to worry about those ones. Which was a pretty fair amount. Okay, now we're gonna have to actually attack it. The quick ball did not work. My arm is numb. It's been numb for over 24 hours now and I don't know what to do about it. find out what's wrong with me soon because I'm just like over it you know I hope they just find out Damn it! God, this thing sucks. Damn it. I'm really hungry. I didn't have breakfast this morning, but I was hoping like I'm gonna get off stream early and then I'll just go get like a uh, go get brunch. Kind of want to get like a smoothie bowl or something like that. I'm so hungry though. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. It's only 8:30. I think I'm gonna be getting off around 11 ish. Damn it! Alright, I'm gonna try a different type of Pokeball. Why are these ones so hard to catch? Maybe I'll try a Dive Ball because we're in the water. Oh! That worked like a charm. I gotta start using more of the special, uh, Pokeballs. Alright, we got the Quillfish. I think we're gonna have to evolve it. I believe. Um, okay, we need this one. I believe we need this one still. Whoops. All right, quick ball. Yes. Yes. I think we must be at like 120 now because we have our next reward. We're chilling. All right, we got that whole evolution set. I do not want to fight you, ho. Get away from me. How dare you just run into me like that? I'm on a mission here. All 
All right, we already have that one. We have that one. Have that one, that one. Okay, honestly, let's just check to make sure since we're here. Do we have this one? I am pretty sure we do. Oh my god, we don't. This whole time. Okay, we gotta make sure we get it then. I actually thought we had this one. Does this one have evolutions? I think it does. Like, in the game. In game. In, in this game. Oh, okay. I can claim my next reward. This is great news. Alright. Let's go look at our Pokédex really quick. Alright, so let's go take a look sees. Let's go! I got a reward. Alright, I have 112. I have 112. Look it! We're really making way. It's starting to look a little bit more full. Oh, I should have caught this one because I saw it. I didn't know I... I thought I had it. Alright, these are the ones we're looking out for. Let me look. Well, I know where the... Um, I know where this one is. So I can easily get that one. Oh, I still need these ones. I thought I had them already. Well, we can go get that one. I might be able to find this one. And then up here is where it's going to get more complicated, I think, so. Anyways. Alright. Let's see here. Do we... We don't have this one. I don't think. Yeah, there's quite a few Pokemons that I can still get before we really look into the details of the more difficult ones. May as well get the easy ones out of the way. I need something to eat. I'm hungry. Come on, man. Ah, I family- oh my gosh. My aunt just messaged us all. Apparently we're doing family pictures next month. I have to find something. The colors are teal, white, like teal? Am I gonna wear that's teal? I gotta look for something that's teal. What kind of colors is that? Teal in like a light orange? Here, this is what my grandma's wearing. I have to find something that matches this. She sent us an example. So something that matches this pattern. Oh my god. Bruh, I... 
I maybe we'll we'll do some online shopping here. Well, I, you know, I have a month. I have a month. Why is this Pokemon such a little bitch? Why is it such a little bitch? Like, out of all the colors, they had to choose teal? Like, that's a difficult color to find, I feel. But, okay. July 20th. July 20th is family pictures at 1 p.m. We're doing it because it's my grandma and grandpa's, um, whoops. It's their 60th anniversary, which is insane. Imagine being with someone for 60 years. Couldn't be me. Like 60 years? Damn. Damn. I can barely be with someone for six months, you know, without getting sick of them. Personally, I just, I can't be bothered. I cannot be bothered. Alright, I need to... There's a couple Pokemon in this area we still need, and then I'm going to go back to a couple of the other areas. I need to find the evolution of this one. I feel like it's definitely going to be available over here somewhere. Okay. Any of these at Kingdra? I don't think any of these are kings. No. The Kingdra has like antlers. Like big ol' antlers. Oh, here we go. There it is. This is the evolution, so. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, there's a few more over here that I still need. I feel like we're making good progress though, like, damn. I feel like I'm making great progress. Alright, we need this one. 
Apparently. I thought this one was already in the game, but apparently I'm wrong. Apparently I'm wrong. I just get so many of the Pokemon games mixed up and like which Pokemon are in each game. I'm so tired. It's so weird because like I'm on summer break and I'm sleeping good and I'm still tired. It's like what? Why am I still tired? I'm gonna hit it one more time. Then we will try to catch it. Alright, we need to use this one. Yes! Honestly, we're not really having too many difficulties catching. It's kind of just working, which is nice. Kind of just working. Alright, we have to find all- oh my god. We have to find all the Porygons. And we will. We we will. All right, this area is much bigger. I could probably Yeah, I need to go like this way of the ice. Like I need to I need to start making my way around because there's probably more that I haven't seen yet let's try going this way yeah let's like go this way maybe I'll try to climb the mountains a bit Ooh, we already have it though. I just don't care care enough. We already have those ones. We have these ones. Why is everybody texting me? It's eight in the morning. I feel like my family is not usually awake this early. All right, we definitely don't have Grand Bull. I know for a fact. All right, let's hit it with the quick ball. See what happens. Yeah, I feel like this one's going to be a little bit harder to catch. I'm going to be honest. It's going to be harder. There's a lot of Pokemon that I see in the background that we do not have. This one's gonna be a bitch, I think, to catch.
Yeah, that's what I thought. Yes, finally. That actually wasn't too bad. Alright, I see a lot in the background that we need. Bada bing, bada boom! Alright, we need this one. He's so angry. He's so angry. Um, okay, let's try the quick ball. There, let's go. I love when the quick ball just works so we can move on with our lives. Now the, the, the shrew, I don't think we got, oh, damn. Damn. Hi, Monkey King. How's it going? I'm just working on my Pokédex. My, uh, my blueberry Pokédex. We're working to complete it just for funsies. We've already beat, like, the, the storyline of the game. We're just doing the Pokédex today. <laughs> Going good, doing some shiny hunting? I'm not. I'm actually working on the Pokédex, but... I honestly might do a day of that. That might be kind of fun. Maybe after I finish the Pokédex, I'll try that out. I already have a few shinies. But I've mostly been focusing on like finishing the storyline, which I just finished a couple days ago. And then now I'm just trying to finish the blueberry Pokédex. I already finished the um the Paldea and Kitakami Pokédexes already. I just have to finish the blueberry one. Damn it. I think this one's gonna be a little bit more of uh, a bitch to catch. But that's okay. Because the other ones haven't been too difficult today. Damn it. We're gonna need some more ultra balls. We're running out. <sighs> I'm so tired today, guys. Oh my god. I don't think I have any other ball that would work better. Maybe we'll use, try to use a, a timer ball soon. the flash cannon. I finished the story on both Scarlet Violet as well as the decks on both games. Oh, nice. That's great. Yeah, I'm almost done. I just got this Pokédex to finish. And then I'm, I'm as good as done. And then we wait for the next Pokémon game. All 
All right, I'm gonna try to use a timer ball and see what happens. Maybe it'll work. Just maybe. Nope, not even, not even a thought. He didn't even think about it. He said nah, right away. Let's go! I wish I would have bought some cereal this week with my groceries. I could really go for a bowl of cereal right now. But I didn't get any. I gotta add that to this next week's grocery order. Hi, Big Dano. How are you doing? Oh no, that's not the one I wanted. Shit. I don't need you, Snover. Alright, I need the shrew. I'm good, and you? I'm doing pretty good. I'm just working on the Pokédex today. The blueberry Pokédex. I have finished all the other Pokédexes. And I finished the story already. So we're just finishing the blueberry Pokédex to wrap it up. Just for fun. Alright, we got it. I love when the quick ball just works, and then we're just vibing. We get to move on. Alright, we got the shrew. Yeah, we have to get the evolution as well, which I don't know if it's out in the wild. We might have to evolve. Um, I think we have big boy already. We don't have, um, this one. This one's creepy looking. I don't like this one. This one's scary. It just has, like, dark black eyes. Oh my god. Damn. Damn. Small but mighty. Oh, he kills himself. Jesus, that is horrible. That is horrible. <laughs> I was not expecting that. I've never fought one of these, so I didn't. I was not expecting that. Ah, you bitch. If you hold down ZL, that's all I have to do is ZL? Bruh, how come nobody ever told me this? How come nobody told me? You need a Pokemon with the ability damp so it won't destroy itself. Okay. Okay. I will work on that. Damp. I don't know if any of my Pokemon have that ability. You know, I just I just think I'll get them eventually, you know? I'll get them. I have that bitch already, I think. Okay, let me try. Oh! That's sick! I love that. I didn't know that this whole time. I love that for me. Now I can actually I can actually see. Okay, let's try another time. Hello, D <laughs> welcome back, Darren. That was quite the entrance. Alright, let's try the quick ball again. I'm just I'm just kinda hoping we get it with the quick ball and then I don't have to worry about abilities. Oh fuck. He 
he just kind of kills himself, and that's just how it is. You know, honestly. That's just how it is. Oh my god. I didn't see this one behind me. Get out of my way, bruh. Alright, let's 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 just move on. I'll c come get that one later when I have the damp ability. I just can't be bothered right now, personally. Alright. I'm gonna go further up the mountain. Do 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 do. Can I go further up this mountain? Climb the mountain. I can get you one. Nah, it's okay, man. I don't have a Nintendo Switch Online right now, so I I don't think I can trade with anybody. I'm on a budget. I had I had to let one of my memberships go, you know. I'm on a I'm on a budget. I'm on that that teacher budget, you know. It's, it's tough out here. I appreciate the offer though. Oh, I got it. Let's fucking go. Now I don't have to worry about it. Let's go! I'm the greatest there ever was. And there ever will ever be. Yeah. I'm spitting. Alright. I think I have I have all these ones. Blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. Alright. What did I miss? I had an ad break. Um, you missed me rapping. That's about it. I was spitting bars. And yeah, that's that. Yeah, I wish I could change the ad breaks, but like I already have it at the least amount of ads possible. Like I don't give a fuck about ads. I already have it on the least possible that I can have it at. I don't give a fuck. Oh. Bruh. Eww. What the fuck is this? I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm hungry. I'm just not doing well. I think I'm gonna order a smoothie bowl. But then by the time it gets here, it's all like melted. I'd rather go like pick it up myself, you know? So, I don't wanna do that. Last time I ordered a smoothie bowl, it was like melted. It's just best to go get it myself. I have to see my grandma Friday, but I'll keep you updated for scary games. Oh, okay. No problem. I can always do plan B. Plan B is life is strange. If you hit X, you can write to the Pokeball. Huh? Okay, if I hit X. Okay. Ah. <gasps> no! No! I didn't mean. Oh, shit. <sighs> I used one of my Master Balls. 
You know, at least, at least he has a nice ball to live in. You know, I, I got two left. I can't believe that just happened. I'm, I'm, I'm Monka pissed. I'm Monka pissed. I didn't, I, it just, it just slid. It just slid. It, it slid on its own. Oh well. I just have to tell myself it's just a game. It's ju it's just a game. It's just a game. <laughs> I was saving those master balls for when I really needed them, you know. Yeah, it, it was stick drift. It really was. I didn't like click next, but it it was still drifting. Honestly, my sticks are kind of sticky. Which, honestly, is kind of gross. Um, I wonder how that happened, but... The sticks be sticky. Anyways... Now that that happened, let's just move on with our lives. Hmm... All right, I'm already seeing a lot that I have. So maybe we change biomes again. I was playing Metroid yesterday and the stick drift was so bad I kept aiming up. Honestly, the Switch does have really bad drift. I will attest to that. It really is bad. Alright, I don't see any Pokemons that I don't already have. So, well, maybe we go down here. Hey, maybe we go down here. I'm gonna go to a different biome. Wee. Wee. I think we already have um Lapras. Okay, let's go to woo 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 woo. Let's go back to the water. Back to the water. I think there's a couple here that I kind of missed. And then we're going to start looking at the Pokédex and try to find specific ones. Because I've kind of caught a lot of the obvious ones. So now... Ooh, we don't have this one. Um, we're going to look for more specific ones now. Alright, slow poke. That was easy. All 
All right, we got slow poke. Let's go. I don't have this one. Oh, it's a stellar. It's a stellar girl. A stellar girly. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. We got the lantern. Okay. I should have most of these now. Okie dokie. Artichoke. Alright, go up. Go up, bruh. Oh god, big boy. Have that bitch. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go backtrack this way. I already have all these ones. Whoops. I already have all those ones. Let's go see what this one is. I need a Kingdra, but I wonder if I just have to evolve to get it, you know? I might just have to evolve. Hydro Cannon. Slime. Ooh, a cave. Uh, nothing good, though. Nothing good. Ah! Alright, maybe... Maybe...
Aha! I have found you. I just need an Umbreon to complete my Pokédex? I think I have an Umbreon. I just can't trade right now because I don't have Nintendo Switch Online. You know, it's tough times out there. I can't afford the $50. It's tough out there as a teacher, you know? It's tough. It's tough out there. I thought it was only $20. Oh, I usually buy the year bundle because it's more of a bargain. You get a better bang for your buck, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah, I usually get the year bundle. I'm pretty sure it's like $50 or something. It's like, I don't want to pay by the month. You know, I, I don't want to do that. Oh, you bitch. Oh, you bitch. Oh, you bitch. Just online is $20? For the whole year? I thought it was $50. What kind of shit did, the, did I buy before then? Mine was $50. Or did that have like the other games involved? What's the year bundle do? I don't know. It gives you a library of games to play. It comes with like some of the old system games. I think... I didn't know that it was $20. I didn't know. Well, on that note, I'll buy that shit. I think before I had done the $50 bundle. The, the $50 and it allows you to have access to a, a library of games. And I honestly didn't really use it anyways. So, you know. This is gonna be a bitch. This is gonna be a bitch. I need to get more Pokeballs. Aw, oh, you motherfucker. Stupid flower bitch. I don't care about you and your beautiful, majestic flowers. I'm going to use the timer ball. Let's go! It worked for once in its life. You get Nintendo Switch Online Plus expansion. Oh yeah, that's what I did before. That's why it was $50? Damn. I could have been doing $20 this whole time. For the whole year. Yeah, that's the one I had gotten before. Damn it, you stupid bird. I see you now. That's the one I'm getting for my dad. He likes retro games. Yeah, honestly, it was kind of cool. If I'm being honest. that It, it is kind of nice. Yeah, you get a whole bundle of retro games. And it even has some newer games, too, that you have access to. Uh, 
so I think it's worth it. <sighs> I'm tired. Let's go. All right, guys, we're making progress. The Super Nintendo was my first game system. Really? I think my first game si si system was a 64. Ugh. 64, and then we also, you know, beyond the 64, we had everything. We had, uh, you know, we got a GameCube, we had all the PlayStations. I mean, we really had everything beyond that. What am I trying to do? Oh, I want to look at my Pokédex. <laughs> Whoops. Had the clear Game Boy Advance. Let's go. I had a Game Boy as well. I don't remember which one. I could show you a picture, I just don't remember. I'm not good with names. I think my shit was... I don't remember. I have a bad memory. 126? That's it? After all that work? We're at 126? I hate my life. Alright. I was exposed to the Jurassic Age of Gaming in my early childhood. I'm exposed to the Jurassic Age. Wow. Darren, that's fantastic. Okay, Rhyperior, we can't get yet. We have to trade. And then, alright, what's 12 and 13? 12 is, oh, yes. We have to evolve Electabuzz, I think. Let's go take a look -sies. Oh, you have to trade. Okay. You have to trade... For that one. So for that now we skip that one until I'm able to trade with somebody. Um number thirteen is Mag B. Where do we get him? The coastal biome. Huh. And then the final evolution for this one Magmortar that one has to also be traded, but we can get these two. But I have to go find him out in the wild. All right. They're found in these areas. Oh, Magmar can be found as well, apparently. Can easily be found in the variety of locations. Which include the southwestern of the savannah, as well as the torchlit labyrinth in the southern part. Okay. Well, we may as well, you know. Um, they're found... Right here, in this area. Kind of, yeah, kind of just in that area. So we're going to go check her out. I wish this map had more flying spots because... It ain't it. Like, I feel like you really- you gotta go miles. I 
don't think we have this one. Yeah, we may as well pick up the ones we don't have along the way because then we don't have to come back. All right, a dupider. Sweet. One less one to worry about. That's it. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, I'm not looking forward to driving an hour to go to the doctor later today. I'm just not. I'm not in the mood for that. I'm kind of like really sick of doctors right now. have that one. Alright, so Magmar apparently is in this location somewhere. I think we have this one, yeah. Apparently we can find them in this location. Oh, in here, in here. It, they're found in, oh god, in here. I have not been down here before, so. Oh, there he is. Sweet! Alright. And apparently Magmar's down here too. Apparently. Bro, look at, I'm rolling up into his face. Look at, I'm right in the middle of the battlefield. I'm rolling up. They should honestly airlift you. You are a Prime Grey's Anatomy patient. <laughs> honestly, yeah, I am. I probably got something rare that would make a good Grey's Anatomy episode. Because, yeah, there's something wrong and my doctors know it, but it's just something rare. I'm going to be... The next step, honestly, is going to be I'm going to get a spinal tap, um, a bone marrow biopsy, and then we're also going to do um, genetic testing on a few things. Um, I'm going to see a geneticist. Royalty to many different doctors. Yeah, basically, but honestly, my doctors haven't been the greatest. I'm going to be honest. Oh, I already have this one. Why did I think I didn't have that? We don't have this bitch. Fucking Diglett. Alright. Gotta get a Diglett. Yeah, I'm actually going to a new doctor on Friday. So today I'm just getting an echocardiogram. And then on Friday I'm going to a new doctor. So we'll see what the new doctor thinks. Honestly, trying to get a diagnosis, you go to many, many doctors and many different specialties until you find out what it is and it sucks. And it's a very long process. I wouldn't wish it on my worst enemy, it's horrible. And then meanwhile, I'm like fainting and having episodes all the time while trying to figure this shit out. It sucks. Oh, where'd bitch go? Yes! Slay, queens! Slay. You girls are looking great. Did they ever check for internal bleeding? No. They haven't checked for half the things they should. Honestly, doctors are just kind of in it for the money, I feel. And same with insurance companies. They basically, they do just enough to keep you alive. And then from there, you know, they don't really care.
Yeah, we've ruled out a lot of things, like... But there's still quite a few things we have to do. I'm, I'm gonna get imaging of my spine and my neck. So... Um, basically, what I have is neurological. But the doctors are only focusing on cardio stuff because I have a blood clot and they just can't get over the blood clot. And I'm like telling them it's not the blood clot. Which, yeah, it's concerning to have a blood clot at 25. But also in the same token, the blood clot isn't even correlating with my symptoms. So let's stop focusing on the blood clot and worry about why I'm fainting. Let's, let's worry about that. Because I saw a neurologist, and all she wanted to talk about was the blood clot. She didn't even address my neurological symptoms. And I'm like, bitch, I'm here for neurological. I don't want to hear about the blood clot anymore. But anyways, that's water under the bridge. I'm just, I'm just, oh, I have this one. Why did I feel like I don't have this one? Oh, fuck. This is a very crowded room. Very crowded. Okay, I already have all those ones. We're just gonna assume. Okay. There's a man down here. Blood clot over brain. Yeah. Basically, that's what's happening. So, I'm going to a new doctor on Friday because she's not gonna, like, ignore my neurological symptoms, hopefully. We have faith in this doctor, so... Yes, that is the plan. Like, they're not even worried about my brain and, like, bruh. I, my arms and legs go completely numb. And I can't move them. Like, what the fuck you mean? So, yeah, anyways. I'm having, like, fainting. I have extreme, so, one of my biggest symptoms, and it's in all of the doctor's notes. So I know I told them. One of the biggest symptoms is extreme pain in the back of my head and numbness in my scalp. And, uh, basically, one of the things we're going to be looking at is a genetic disorder called Kari malformation. It's where, you're a, when you're a baby, your head doesn't fully close, and people have it their whole lives without knowing until suddenly in their 20s they start having symptoms. And then you have to have a surgery, basically, to fix it. Um, we think we have that, but no one has scanned that area of my head, so they're not going to know. But, yeah, I'm waiting on getting the back of my head scanned to find that out. But, yeah. Anyways. Okay, where's Magmar? He should be down here. I don't see the man. Ooh, a secret path. Cause would be because of the clot. I mean, blood is the powerhouse of your body. It is not the clot, but yeah, I know what you're saying. We pretty much we know it's not the clot because of the pain in the back of my head and my spine. Most of my issues are coming from the back of my head and my spine, so we know it's not just the clot because the clot's in my lung. And the clot should actually be dissolved by now because I've been on blood thinners for over a month and it's very likely that the blood clot's already dissolved according to my hematologist. So, I don't know. We're gonna rescan my chest to see the lung again to see if it's gone, but we're gonna wait three months. And my blood clot was um, written up as chronic, so it's not acute. So it's not really causing any danger to me. It will give me some certain symptoms, but 
It is not the chief concern. Bruh. I don't know how to find the magmar. You might just have to evolve. Maybe I'll go look in the savanna biome. So, magmar can also be found... Yeah, Magmar can be also found in the savanna biome, like anywhere over in this general direction. Um, they have checked my blood for, uh, clotting disorders, and I am negative for most, uh, or for all of the clotting disorders so far. So, it's not a blood issue, and blood clots can be caused by many other conditions. So, um, yeah, we think the blood clot is secondary to something else. We're just trying to find what that something else is. But anyways, it's just been a real bitch. Is all I gotta say. But today it will be the day to rule out... This is my last heart test, basically, to rule out um, a heart issue. Because I haven't had an echo yet. So this honestly will rule out anything with my heart. Wilden. Damn, he hit me in one shot. I only have one Ultra Ball left. One Ultra Ball in a dream. Okay, I'm gonna go buy some more though. And heal up my Pokemon. Sweet. All right. Uh, the last evolution we can't really get because um, because we have to trade. So we'll have to save that one for trading as well. Do 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 do. Okay, I'm gonna heal them. My legs are getting really numb and stiff sitting like this. Maybe I'll put them down. Ugh. My legs are really numb today.
Okay, what next? What are we looking for next? We have 131. Let's go. So I have like a hundred more. All right. We can't get that one. I'll creamy. How do we get Al creamy? Um, uh, sweet item and spin. Okay, that sounds interesting. A sweet item and spin. Okay, so we need... What does it mean by spin? At night. Okay, this is interesting. This is a very interesting way to evolve something. All right, let's grab it. Where is it? Okay, we have to have it hold the sweet item and then we have to spin it at night, which is really weird. Honestly, I'm a little weirded out. What counts as a sweet item? Oh, let's see here. Mm. Okay, here we go. Berry sweets. Oh, this will make it blue. I like that. And then when it's nighttime, we have to spin it. Oh, it is nighttime. Well, damn. Okay. Um, I hope I'm doing this right. Like, we just spin it like a ballerina. I'm spinning like a ballerina. Spin. Spin, bitch. I'm spinning it. I'm spinning it. I'm doing it. Did I not do it? Is that not correct? I would say this is nighttime, right? Maybe we have to be out in the wild. Hey, come back. Spin, bitch. Spin, bitch. I don't get it. Um, you can get a sweet as a reward. Give them the sweet. Spin in place using the right analog stick or the left choice. Okay. I'm doing it. Yes. <laughs> That's such an interesting way to evolve a Pokemon. So interesting. It's gonna be blue. What? Excuse? Did I cancel it? I I gen I'm really bad about that. Okay, don't cancel it, Audrey. Don't cancel it. Let's go! Let's go! Alright, we got that one. 
So there's many different forms of that one depending on what sweet you give it. You can have many different colors. So that's kind of cool. Alright. Um, we got that one. Alright, Kingdra. How do we get our Kingdra? Because that's annoying. Alright, 54. Kingdra. I don't think they can be... Oh, trading. Trade with Dragon Scale. Trade with Dragon Scale. Alright, that's another trading one. Whimsicott. Whimsicott. I'm really bad at names. Um, use the Sunstone. Apparently they can be found in the coastal biome. Whimsicott location. Let's see here. What exact location? Send me your location. Apparently it can be found up here. Alright, I'll give it a go. Apparently it can be found here. And then up in this area too, so. But let's try that little spot first. But apparently it can be found all around up here. Which, I don't know. I've never seen it, so. I beg to differ. Send me your location. Ah, I'm so sleepy. I'm gonna have to sleep good tonight, because I'm tired. Well, I don't see one here, so... Alright, let's go off to the next spot. So next it can be found- it can be found anywhere basically on this little island and in the water area. So all of this area. We're gonna go scout the whole area. If I can't find it, I'm just gonna try to evolve it. I don't know if I have a sunstone. I'm gonna have to check. Wait. Uh, nope. They kind of look similar. So, they they look very similar. I need this one, too. Alright. Um, quick ball. Damn it! Damn it! I have the wrong Pokemon out. I got the wrong Pokemon. I don't know what I'm doing. I need my, uh, yeah. I went to sleep at 3 this morning, can't stop watching Shameless. <gasps> I love Shameless! How far are you? Such a good show. I, fr I know this is probably unpopular opinion, I just love Frank. I think Frank is so funny. Like, I, I don't love him as a person, but like, he's just- he is kind of fucking funny. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's- he's just funny. 
I hate, um, what's her face? I hate Debbie, is that her name? What, what's that, the youngest girl's name? I, she's so annoying. I can't stand her. Debbie biting the curb for Kale Tree HD. I can't stand the girl. She's just the most annoying character in my opinion. I can't stand her. I like Carl. Carl's cool. Carl's kind of a savage. Yeah, I like Frank. Frank is funny. I I don't I he's he's a shitty person, obviously, but like he's kind of fucking funny. Alright, um... Alright, we're looking for the Whimsicott. We will find the Whimsicott. I feel it in my jellies. Okay, it's not on that island. But it can be in this area. Can be all over this island. Horrible father, but probably the best character of the show comedy wise. Oh yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, horrible shitty person. Like, if he was a person in real life, absolute shit. But for the the, the purpose of entertainment, he's funny as hell. I I do enjoy his character. It's just <laughs> he's just He's just a hot mess. Like, he is just a mess. And it's the fact that, like, he thinks he's a good person. <laughs> he kind of just beats to his own drum. And then he has all these kids running around. I might just have to evolve. Oh, wait. No, that's the cottony. They kind of look similar. I think the Whimsicott's a little bit bigger. How do you wake up in Mexico? <laughs> I know, the shit he does. The shit he does. I, I find it funny that he thinks Liam is his son. No, doesn't, wait. I'm trying, I haven't watched this show in probably like five years. Doesn't he eventually find out Liam really is his son? Don't, don't do- they do- I- I'm trying to- I can't remember. But like at the beginning it's just funny like he had no doubts Liam's his son. I think that they did find out that it actually is true. But I don't remember. I haven't seen the show in many years. I don't remember the details. I don't know. Carl is probably one of my favorites. I like Frank and I like Carl. And I, I haven't gotten that far. Oh. Okay, I won't I won't spoil anything. I'm sorry. I can't remember how many seasons there are. I probably haven't watched like the latest season or yeah, or so. I just haven't had time to like catch up on all my shows. Jimmy just came back and Monica almost killed herself. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're not that far then. Yeah, I honestly, I think I might not have finished like the last season or so. Cause yeah, most of my shows I haven't because I just got so busy. Alright, I can't find this Whimsicott. I might just evolve, but I have to see if I have a... a sunstone. Let's see if we have a sunstone. Oh, Monica. Monica's a hot mess, too. I don't think I have a sunstone.
I don't. I actually don't have many stones at all. Hmm. We might run into Whimsicott at some point. Alright, we're gonna skip over Whimsicott for now. Alright, we're at the two hour mark. I'm gonna stream for a little bit longer. And then I'm gonna have to go soon. Okay, we're at 133. I feel like we were pretty successful today, regardless. Alright. The slow bro. I have a feeling that one is gonna be hard to get. Oh yeah, we gotta we gotta get it to level 37. Okay. We gotta get a slow poke to 37. So that's not bad. Not too shabby. This one's already leveled up enough. Wait. Oh, it depends on the type that you have. Let's see. Do I have a... Um... Do I have another? So if I use that type with the yellow head, it's going to be different than the other one. Slow poke. Slow poke. So I have a slow bro. I think I have to get... I already have a slow bro. Maybe I have to actually have the uh, the other kinds. Oh, we have to get a specific kind it looks like. I think I think they're different. We have to have this specific slow bro. Even though I already have one, but you have to get the this these ones. God, my internet is trash. It's not letting me see it. And then we have to get a slow king, which I think we're not gonna be able to do. Why is this not working? My internet is not working. Is the stream still going? Well, it says I'm still streaming. Am I still streaming? Oh, I am. Then why isn't this working? I'm still streaming. Why isn't my browsers working? I can't search anything. But it says my stream's not dropping frames or anything. Okay. Blueberry Pokédex. We are alive. Okay. Alive and well. Well, maybe not well. Alright, let's see here. Alright, slow bro. I have to get this specific slow bro. I have to get... I have to get a Galarcia Cuff. Do I have that? Do I have that? No, how do I get that? How do we get this? Trading in twigs to an NPC near the vending machines. 
Oh, we have to do some. We have to do some NPC work to get it, so we can evolve it. All right. Trade eight twigs for one cup. There's a child who asks you for twigs and offer you wreaths or cups in exchange. How do we get twigs? <laughs> How do we get the twigs, though? Oh. Found in the beach area. Okay. Alright, I have to go talk... To, well, let's go to the beach area first. And then I'll go talk to the kid. Apparently, if you go to this beach area... You can find twigs, and we need eight of them to get a cuff, and then we can evolve the slowpoke. Is apparently what's happening here. I think this is the kid. Yeah, this is the little kid. This is the kid we have to bring it to, I think. Yeah. Okay, I need eight twigs. This is a lot of work just to evolve one Pokemon. It's kind of annoying, I mean, personally. All right, we're looking for sparkly items on the ground. We gotta just go around the beach at all the sparkly spots. God damn, these twigs are hard to find. A float stone. It's a lot of sparklies. I want to see what the twigs look like. Hmm. I'm going to go to the other beach because that's what's marked on this map. Eight twigs. Eight of them. And I haven't even found one. Okay. Ooh, I got one. Alright, I got one. Two. Three. Three. Still three. Still three. Damn. Four, five. Oh, they come in packs of two. Well, sometimes. Sometimes they come in clusters of two. I might have enough. All right, let's check. Let's check my bag. Where's the twigs? I have eight. Let's go. All right, I need a cuff. I need a cuff. Give me that cuff, bitch. All right, we're doing it. All right. We got it. All right, we got to give it to the slowpoke. Hmm. All right. We're going to evolve it. Where's the cuff? Where's the cuff? Right here. <gasps> a 
Let's go. That was easy. That actually wasn't too bad. Oh, I see. And if we want to slow king, we're going to do the wreath. Okay. Not too bad. All right, we got the slow poke. And then we next we have to get the slow king. So we evolve the same slow poke, but, you know. Now, how many do we... Do we... How many do we... Uh, Um, I need to go catch another slowpoke. And then... How many do we need for a wreath? Fifteen! Fifteen! Jesus! Alright. Let's go catch it. We gotta catch one more slowpoke. And then more twigs. We gotta get 15 this time. This kid is running a expensive business. Can they be in the water? No. Maybe not. I think I already collected them all. I might have to wait for them to replenish. I might have to wait for them to replenish. Alright, I'm gonna catch one of these because we're gonna need another one to evolve it. Let's go. Okay. Sweet. Alright, I'm gonna take that one out and switch it. Cuff it, cuff it, cuff it, cuff it, baby. Alright, we're gonna switch these two. There we go. Alright, so we gotta evolve that one into a slow king. But we need 15 twigs, which is absurd. I personally think it is ridiculous. Well, I'm gonna have to come back when it's replenished because I already took all the twigs. But that's okay. We'll save that one for next time. That's A-OK. -okay. Alright, now we have number 81, which is Malamar, which is the Inke evolution. Let's see how it's evolved. Level 30 while holding Nintendo Switch upside down. Handheld mode only. Well, I'm going to do that off stream then. That is stupid. <laughs> I can't believe that's how you evolved that one. Hey, let me do it real quick. I'm kind of curious. That's going to make me dizzy as fuck. Like, I just hold it upside down. Like, I'm gonna look like a dumbass doing this. Okay. Alright, hold on. Hold on. Let me hold it upside down. Oh, this is hard. This is like X Games mode. This doesn't work. I'm doing it. I really have to think about this. Hi, Ian. This is probably looks really strange, but... 
Um, one of the Pokemon you have to evolve holding your switch upside down. <laughs> How to evolve Inke. Um, to evolve Inke, your Inke has to be at least level 30, and while it levels, you have to be holding your Nintendo Switch upside down. Ugh. Monka. This is hard. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna level it up. I'm sad I can't show you guys this. Oh, amazing gameplay. I remember doing this on my DS. It's stupid. I hate it. Alright, let's click that. Use it on this guy. It didn't work yet. Hold on. I have to level it up. Okay. It didn't work. It did not work. I leveled it up. I used a rare candy. And that shit didn't work. It still didn't work, bitch. I need a tutorial. I, my PC is not working either. Nothing's working. You know, this might be one I have to monkey around with. Why did we stuff Reese's Take 5 with five flavors? Because you can't handle six! Why did we stuff Reese's Take 5 with five flavors? Because you can't handle six! That's intense. Peak confidence. I might just do this one off stream when I'm like chilling. Nothing is working. It's not. My PC's not working. A little bit different in that there's a very particular way that you'll. Alright. We'll go ahead and quick ball it. You need at least level 30. Ours is 67. So we only need to level it up one time. But this isn't going to work. We can't do it this way. We need to connect our Joy Cons. And then actually remove our switch. So if I switch it over here, we're going to use our rare candy on Inke upside down. I did. That is correct. You need to flip it upside down. One, Inke will level up. And that's how you do the evolution. I did, bitch. I'm pissed. I'm pissed. I wasted my only rare candy on that. Alright, on to the next Pokemon. I'm gonna do that one a different time. And then here I am looking like a dumbass with my Switch upside down. Like, maybe I wasn't holding it upside down enough. Maybe it was my fault. All right, what's number 91? All right, our Dewpiter needs to be level 22. So this one should just evolve easily. Easily. I'm just going to give it a candy and level it up. I don't know if I, I can. I don't want to waste all my candies, but eh, we're almost done with the game anyways. We can't see the game? Oh. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. All right, at least this one's evolving. That's good news. All 
Araquanid. Sweet. That one, why can't they all be that easy? Why can't we all be that easy? All right, what's next? We're at 135. All right, 93 and 94. Oh, yes, okay. Hitmonlee and Hitmonchan are the next ones. And I have Hitmon top already, which is great. Um, so basically you take this bitch and you can evolve him in many different ways to get these two. So um level 20 attack less than defense at 20. This one is attack greater than defense at 20. And that, this one is when it's equal. I might just be able to catch them. I think these ones are catchable, though. And if they're catchable, well, you know. We might go that route. 98. Um, we have to trade to get this one. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can find these ones in the wild. Because I don't feel like it. Can't believe upside down. That's ridiculous. All right, it lives in caves. All right, so Hitmonlee is uh, down in this direction. Let me zoom in on this picture. All right, he is. He is down here in this area. I think there's some caves maybe down there. Apparently he lives in caves. My mom's wondering where I am. God, mom, leave me alone. I'm trying to fill out my Pokedex. Doesn't she know? It's tough work out here being a Pokemon player. Yeah, I'm probably just gonna play a little bit more. I am supposed to head to my mom soon. So, I will, you know, I will be going soon. Just a short little stream today, just some Pokemon shenanigans. But we'll be back stronger tomorrow. To play our one true love, Life is Strange. Or not Life is Strange. Hogwarts Legacy. We'll play Life is Strange on Friday. Yeah, just a small stream. But honestly, I've been streaming so much. Like, you know, doing a small stream is okay. You know, I've been streaming too much. When I was younger, I used to be scared of Hitmonlee. He just is kind of scary looking. Kind of looks like Slenderman. It's just kind of tall and scary. You know? You're just kind of creepy. Yeah, tomorrow we're going to play more Hogwarts Legacy is the plan. Do another long Hogwarts Legacy day. Really? Yeah, I was kind of scared of him, I'm not gonna lie. I think there's a cave here, yeah. Alright, there's a cave here, and I think they are in caves. Yep, yeah. Oh, I am terrified. I don't like it. I don't like it.
Oh, you missed it, Ian. We accidentally used a Master Ball earlier, and that was traumatizing. But, you know, it is what it is. At least I have two more left. I still have two more. Alright. We got the Hitmonlee. Thank God I don't have to get it again. It's so creepy. I was scared of it when I was younger. Not the Master Ball. Yeah, I did accidentally use it. It was quite not good. Okay. The next one is Hitmonchan. And honestly, like... I'm not as scared of Hitmonchan. Because, like, you can see his face. You know, he's not, like, this ominous thing, you know. Alright, let's see. I already have Hitmontop. Alright, Hitmonchan is... On the other side of this biome. He is... Like... Uh, up here, there's a... He's right here, it says. Right in here. So, we're gonna... We're gonna head that way. And see if that... The rumor is true. Alright, I can only play for a little bit longer. How many Pokemons are we at? Maybe once we get to 140, we we get off. Four more Pokemons. Four more. Hey, 140 is pretty successful. That means we got 40 po Pokemon today? 40? That's pretty good. I'm not mad about it. Okay, apparently he's in this area. I don't know exactly where in this area, but, like, in this area is where it says. I don't understand where he could be. Is he on top of the mountains? It has just this little square marked in this area. Maybe I should just look up a video. Because I'm not seeing a whole lot of anything. Maybe he's... I don't know. Let's look up a video. How to catch Hitmonchan. My name is Darren Tomasso. I'm a Nike NYC trainer, and I'm wearing the Nike Zoom TR1. Yeah, I got like it's 40 Pokemon enough. today, which, honestly, good. Everybody, it's Techno here, and today I'm going to show you the easiest way of finding Hitmonchan in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet's DLC. Okay. You can start off by visiting the Canyon Plaza okay. Flypoint. You okay. want to mark this little spot over here, this dark tan cloud-shaped area of the map. Uh, you'll see this little spot. I was a little bit off. But I was going by this really weird map. Alright, he's right in here. This man marked this area. Oh! Is this him? No, it's not. It's not him. I was gonna say, maybe it's that one. But it's not. Well, the fuck? Is there a cave? Maybe I should finish watching the video. Oh, there's a cave. I bet the boy is in here. Nope, he's not in here. Sag. Alright, let's actually watch the full video. Wow, you can just mark right there. Go ahead and head that direction. This is one of the very few instances where I seriously recommend eating a sandwich. More specifically, I recommend eating sandwich number 70. It'll boost fighting type encounter rates pretty significantly. Once you get to this area, you'll be able to see on the side of this uh, mountain here, you'll be able to go into a small cave. Now, Hitmonchan can spawn here pretty rarely. I got it on my first try, which is pretty lucky. But if you don't oh. get it on your first try, what you want to do is actually leave the cave. In fact, 
Leave the cave so far back that you despawn everything inside of it like this, and then just turn around and go back in. That will reset the spawns, and guess what? I got lucky enough to get a Hitmonchan again. I'm two for two, and you probably won't be, so just keep going back and forth over and over again until you do see that Hitmonchan there. You don't need the sandwich necessarily, but it will help tremendously. So that's how you find Hitmon- Damn. We might just have to figure out how to evolve it. He says go back far enough to reset the cave and then keep going back in. Imagine? 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 Ah, oh, we got little guy. We got little guy. Nope. Maybe if I do this like a hundred times. Ah, you motherfuck. Yeah, he is rare. I need to eat a certain sandwich though, and I'm kind of lazy. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. I gotta fight this guy? Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm just trying to vibe here. This guy ruined it. I'm hungry and I'm tired and my legs are numb, so that's fun. I'm kind of getting sick of not feeling my body very well. You know, I, I'm not really liking it anymore. Numb? Yeah, my whole body is kind of numb right now. I had a, a fainting episode kind of last night. And my body numbness hasn't really coming back. Damn, nothing in there. Damn. Little guy. Damn. Do you think I'm gonna get it, guys? Do you think I'm gonna get it? Do you guys think I have good luck? Nope. Just little guy. Nope. Oh my god. Get out of here, bruh. He's- 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 he's guarding the cave. You little bitch! I have faith. Okay. I kind of want to do it, you know? I kind of want to do it this way. To prove to myself that luck is on my side. Nope. Just a little guy. I didn't- I didn't know you could reset the caves by debating it like this. Yeah, he's camping me. Like, bruh, you already had your moment. I already caught you. Okay. Okay. Do you guys think I should get that sandwich? Can't see. Okay, yeah, that's a uh, little guy. Come on. Imagine I finally get it, though, and then I accidentally, like, kill it or something. Like, that would be tragic. God, he's really camping me. Like, can he not be in front of the cave? Look at all them. Look at these guys going in front of the cave. Come this way. Come at me, bruh. He's really standing there. It's giving me flashes to my shiny hunting days. Yeah. 
God damn. I'm flying in, boys. I'm flying in to get over this guy. Okay, I don't like this. This is boring. I don't think it's resetting the cave very well. I'm gonna go a little bit further. Nope. Nope. Oh. That scared me. Alright, I'm gonna do two more tries. Two more tries. Little guy. Okay, one more try, one more try. We'll, we'll do this a different day. I don't want to waste all my time. Because I gotta get off. Last try, last try. Last try. Last try? Damn it. Well. Well. That's okay. We'll find him a different time. Alright. We can't get that one. Excadrill. I think we can go catch this one. We just have to find it. Yeah. This one can be easily found or leveling up the other guy. Excadrill location. Yeah, I don't think this one's very hard to get. I just... It can be really found anywhere in the cannon. Just anywhere. Apparently I've seen it before. We'll come back and do this cave thing another time. So we're trying to find Drillbur's evolution is what we're trying to do. I like how rocky this area is. It's a lot of fucking climbing. Ooh, what's that over there? A stellar Pokemon. I wonder which one it is. Oh. Oh. I thought it was gonna be something cool. Alright, let's go this way. I'm kind of honestly a little burnt out from the day. <laughs> I'm a little burnt out from catching Pokemon. I think I need a break. I mean, we're at 136. We, m we could call it there. A big cave. I'm gonna go in the cave. Look at how big this fucking cave is. Oh, fuck. I don't need you, bruh. Oh. We don't have, um... Some of these. I haven't been in this cave yet, though. 136 is pretty good. Yeah, honestly, for only playing a couple hours, 
I'm kind of getting down to the nitty gritties, you know, the more difficult to get ones. So, you know, it's going to start slowing down here. We're getting down to the nitty gritties. Well, perfect. Look at that. You ask and you shall receive. This is going to be number 138 to our Pokédex. God, the quick ball is where it's at. Alright, we got Excadrill. Let's go. One thirty nine. We still might get to one forty. We still might get there. This is one thirty nine. I like how quickly these uh, catches are. I have to get off in for sure in 15 minutes. Oh! By 11. Alright, let's see if we can find one more to make it 140. How about, how about that? There has to be one more measly Pokemon in this cave, right? Ooh, shit. Sparkly. Come on, there's gotta be one more down here that I don't have, right? There's gotta be. This is a pretty big cave with lots of Pokemons. This looks scary. Holy shit. I can feel the electricity flowing. Well. We're at 139. And I'm tired. So. I'm gonna save. I think that's a good spot to end. We did, we did the most today. Okay. Saved game. Bada bing, bada boom. All right, guys, I'm exhausted. I have to go to the doctor soon. I'm going to my mom's house for a little bit before the doctor. We have a few things that we're going to do. So I'm going to part ways here. I think. Um, just a short, sh short stream today. All right, just a short stream. Um, I'll be back tomorrow. Yeah, I have to go to the doctor. It's not a bad one today. They're just doing the echocardiogram. So I pretty much just have to lay there and do nothing. So. That should be great. Um, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow. Um, tomorrow we are going to... 
play more Hogwarts Legacy, like a longer Hogwarts Legacy stream again, because I'm trying to grind the game. So longer Hogwarts Legacy tomorrow, Friday, um, probably more Life is Strange on Friday. That's kind of the plan. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this very short little morning stream. Um, yeah, my legs are completely numb, so I'm going to go try to walk without falling down. But I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. All right. Bye.